hi lovelies welcome back to my channel so today is an unboxing video ah <sighs> yes as you can see from the beautiful orange box there is a new new interesting addition to my collection um if you guys can guess what is in this bag please put it in the comment section down below however of course i'm going to be unboxing this in a second so yeah what do you guys think it is hmm. okay of course from the size of the bag from the of course from the size of the box you can tell it is a bag i think okay drum roll please of course, I think this is the um, the holiday collection, the, the ribbon. So here she is. 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 I am so, so surprised. Let me tell you guys, I am so surprised that I am doing this unboxing. Because, honestly, I need to stop going to the stores. Really. But... That's a different a different conversation for another day. I honestly, I'm in love with the color. And I'm in love with the versatility of this purse. I had had, you know, mixed emotions and mixed feelings about, you know, adding this to my collection. I never, honestly, to be honest, I never even thought about adding it to my collection because... I really just never thought about it. I just thought it was it was a nice bag and you know everybody talked about the fact that social media was trying to force it down our throats. However, whenever I went to the store, then my opinion changed. And when I saw this color, my opinion changed even more. So of course, this is the Louis Vuitton Cousin, is it Cousin or Cousin? My SA called it the Cousin, and this is in the size PM. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. It has three compartments. You can see the middle compartment is right here, the front and the back. And it uh, comes with two straps. So, I don't know if you guys can see the color. This is not a black. This is more like a charcoal silvery gray. I want to see what color it exactly is because I didn't purchase it online. I went into the store and picked it. I just saw the color and I was like, okay, you know what? I like that color. I like that. I like that. I like that. So let's see exactly what it's called. So this is the name of the color. It is called the anthracite. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it well. I probably am not pronouncing it well. <laughs> bear with me okay bear with this is the bag right here i'm just taking a look at you know the the whatever is that they, that they put in there the exterior purse the exterior fabric of the material of the fabric of the purse is lambskin but the interior is actually cowhide so it's um 100 leather this is a made in france piece I know I've gone on a rant with Made in France or Made in USA. I have no idea if there is any of the cousins who are actually, that are actually made in the US. I have seen videos that have talked about Made in, um, in uh, Italy, but I don't know about USA. Please, you guys, if you guys know if they're actually made, if there's some Made in USA, please let me know in the comment section down below. Well, to be honest, this is giving me black vibes in the camera but i'm looking at it and i see that it's a gray it's like a silvery dark silvery gray i love it so much it's the color honestly that really stood out to me because to be honest i was leaning more towards the um camo color and um i was leaning towards like the taupe color but this one was well, just like you know what it's different it's different and the fact that this actually has um what's it called the silver hardware i was kind of like a little bit you know apprehensive 
but I have, you know, a lot of all the black, well, that's not true. I have two black purses in my collection now. I have the um, Chanel Classic Flap and Small, and that's um, with um, gold hardware, the yellow gold hardware. I'm just going to bring the Classic Flap for you guys to see the difference in color, just to give you a better, you know, idea of what this really looks like in person. So can you guys see the difference? You see that this one is more of a gray tone. I don't know why I just felt like it probably was it's picking as um was picking as black like a kind of like a shiny black, but you can see this is totally different. So it actually comes with silver hardware. I know there are a lot of a few of them that actually come in silver. So it has the um this strap that comes with it. I really like this strap. A lot of the other colors have like lighter straps and more like edgy straps. This is already edgy enough. I would not want it in a brighter color. So I really like the fact that this came in the black. And of course, it comes in this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful um, silver um, chain strap as well so you can wear this as a shoulder strap it can be worn as a clutch it can be worn as a crossbody bag i love the versatility about the purse i'm so glad they made changes to um the flap that was that that was poking out on the previous um designs i mean that really sucks for people who purchased this bag earlier um because i feel like that portion that just you know kept sticking out was just like irking me however of um, or the newer variation doesn't have that issue. So this is what it looks like with the chain strap. Of course, this would, can be worn um, as a top handle bag. And you can hold it this way. I mean, most times I probably wouldn't do that. I'd probably just wear it over my shoulder. I'm a shoulder strap girl for sure. Or honestly, if I'm not wearing it as a shoulder strap, I probably will be wearing this as a crossbody bag with this black um strap right here i know shay whitney talked about the fact that the, the the chain like getting stuck underneath the purse irked her and i'm starting to see that i mean hopefully it doesn't irk me so much but i love the look of the back it's such an edgy purse at the same time so <sighs> i wanted to say understated but looking at the the <laughs> monogram embossing i'm like okay keep quiet girl keep quiet but it's i mean it's just so 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 pretty and wearing it as a clutch would definitely be a beautiful beautiful option as well it has the uh, the three compartments on the inside like i said the inside the interior of the bag has cowhide um it's all leather i know the larger ones have um suede in them but this one has 100% leather on the inside. It's also gray. Um, the color on the inside is like a very dark gray. It has the Louis Vuitton Paris um, inscription on the inside over there. It has that compartment on the on both sides and it has the interior compartment as well. I like the fact that I love bags that have compartments. I don't mind it, especially the fact that, you know, this could be like a night purse and like a dressy bag that I can just wear under my arm my armpit and you know i'm good to go for the night i like it a whole lot i would have gotten the camel but i'm actually glad i bought this because this is so not me and i don't have oh sorry i don't have um anything like this in my collection funky yet classy the color is so edgy yet subtle mm. Yeah, I mean, of course, I don't have any cons yet about the bag because I haven't. <laughs> this is an unboxing video. I don't have any cons yet about it. I would definitely be coming back to do like a detailed review on the purse. This is just an unboxing video just for you guys to, you know, get a nice look into this purse. We'll be traveling um, for the new year and this is definitely something I'm going to be taking with me. It's lambskin, yes, but... I felt softer lambskin, okay? Um, the purse I'm actually taking, I took out today was my Chanel um, Pearl Crush. 
mini um and honestly that's the softest leather i have to date you know a lot of bags a lot of bags deep so mm -mm, this is still nice and sturdy feeling compared to that my only concern um, will be like the corners and just making sure that you know i'm being careful with it but i love the fact that i can carry this crossbody because i'll be traveling with my toddler and um of course the color just you know makes for it me being more comfortable with it traveling with it you know i'm gonna just lay it flat put it in this um dust bag and i'm sure we're gonna be good so that's something to be very uh happy about so yeah um please let me know what you guys think about this purse let me know what you think about the color in the comment section down below have you seen this color in the market yet have you come across this so far um let me know what you guys think um and yeah please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel to see more content like this thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye